And it says, And he arose and rebuked the wind and said to the sea, Peace be still. And the wind ceased, and there was a great calm. And he said unto them, Why are you so fearful? And how is it that you have no faith? And they feared exceedingly and said one to another, What manner of man is him, even at the wind and the sea obey him? Talking with the guides and those that were involved, we don't know specifically and accurately. There's no inscription that says Jesus was physically here, but it definitely has everything that's necessary to point to the reality that when God rose Jesus from the dead and the tomb was owned by a man, Joseph of Arimathea, his wealth itself spoke for this area. And today, as we just reflect on the reality of this empty tomb, know that you were there and that not only you were there, but you rose together with him. You, my friend, my brother, my sister, those that from around the world you are looking, how could I ever be in Jerusalem with Pastor Gary? I believe God who is going to send his son back with clouds of glory to open this mountain and enter in through the eastern gate is able to provide every need in your life. Open your heart. Believe God. The finances are available. There's nothing can stop you. Be with us in Jerusalem. Yeah.